You know when you're playing Roblox on your phone or tablet, and your game just starts to lag, and you just want to rage and smash your phone into a million pieces? Well, lucky for you, you don't have to do that, because I'm here to help. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you all the different ways that you can fix lag on your phone or tablet, so that you can start playing Roblox again smoothly without any stupid lag. Alright, so I'm going to cover all the different things that you need to do to fix Roblox lag. First things first, if you have any apps running in the background, you want to make sure you close them and swipe up on them, so that nothing's running in the background while you're playing Roblox that could hinder the game's performance. Once you do that, you want to go through your phone and just uninstall any apps that either you don't use anymore or that are really massive and that could be taking up a lot of space on your phone. For example, I don't play this game anymore, so I'm just going to delete it. And you just want to do that with all the apps that you can. Also, an easy fix might just be restarting your device. And to do that, you just want to press down the volume and power button. But then you just want to turn your device off, wait about five minutes, and then turn it back on. The next thing you need to do is just make sure your device is updated. And to do that, you just go to your settings. And if your phone needs to be updated, there should be a notification here so that you're able to do that. And it might take like 10 minutes to update your phone, but it should help out with your performance too. But also, you need to make sure that your Roblox app is updated too. And the best way to do that is just uninstall it and then go back to the app store and then search up Roblox and then just reinstall it again and you'll have the latest version. Some other things that you can also do is when you find a game that you want to play, just scroll down and press on servers and then sort by ascending. And there will be servers with only one or two people in them and you want to join those ones if you can because less players means less lag in the entire server so it should help you out quite a bit. And also remember, if you're on a mobile device, try to play Roblox as close as you can to your home router so that you have the best Wi-Fi signal possible. Now that you don't have any more lag on Roblox anymore, you might be looking for some fun Roblox games to play. And if you want to know some of my favorites, click on this video right now and I'll show you the best Roblox mobile games that you can play right now that are personally some of my favorite Roblox games of all time. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and I'll catch you in the next one.